I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Spider-Man 2. We are here. Um, you might have seen my video just abruptly end, only simplistically because I ran out of space. <laughs> so I had to make some space. And here we are. All right, so I don't know what we're looking for right now, but let's scan. I'm too far. Hold on. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Okay, hold L2. Right. Take your time. Hold on. Uh, got it. Move to a position where you can yank the panel into a, the reveal location. Ah! Another there key. we go. Sweet. Got it. Can't pull it open from down here. Are you from down here? The hell is it? Oh, you said from down here. Hold on, I'm, I'm tripping. I went. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Yo, this is next level, man. Hit this whole room in plain sight. Cool. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? All suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. You received a rare tech part. Use your resources to unlock new suits, gadgets, and and suit tech. You can boost your combat and... I'm not going to read that right now. I just woke up. <laughs> Capabilities by, by upgrading suit tech. Select health. Upgrade your health. I need that. <laughs> Let's do that. I need that. Cool. Collect and use additional resources to further upgrade your suit tech. Does this go for both of them? Huh, we at 120 now. What what are we doing? Yeah, 120 health. Let's get it. We can't do damage yet. Yeah, we can't do damage yet. But we got health, so that's great. I guess it works for both of them. Cool. Listen, this isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay, I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles, me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con. Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah, ¿y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. Okay. Someone's playing with fireworks? Bad idea. I'm about to say what? Hold. Hold up. I'll hit you back. Fireworks? 
Better warn those guys they're illegal here without a permit before someone calls the cops on them. Damn, Genki just hit me and I said, I'll, call, I'll hit you back. <laughs> Hold on, because there's something going down that, that, need, that requires my attention. Oh, God. Form. Be there soon. Yeah, I'll be there soon. Oh, set photo op. Hold on. Sorry. 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 Oh, I have to swipe up. <laughs> Tripping. Perfect for Robbie. Okay. Okay. I mean, if I was rich, I'd take advantage of that backdrop too. I'd also be worried about constantly launching balls off the roof, but I guess they can afford it. Damn, what the hell is this shit? Damn it. Another day, another disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what should have been a routine prison transfer, the Spider-Men felt the need to inject themselves into a situation that was already being handled by the proper authorities and completely botched it. A new group of mercenaries made their presence known in the hijacking of the supervillain Scorpion and Mr. Negative. Not much is known about this new collective, other than their penchant for animal skins. But one thing is abundantly clear. Spider did nothing to impede them. Had law enforcement been allowed to do their jobs, these criminals wouldn't be in the wind right now. Looks like we have an eyewitness calling in. Caller, you're live. Hi, Jonah. Thanks for having me. Just want to point out that what you're saying is a total lie. Here we go. I was there on the pier. Law enforcement was completely outmatched. The Spider-Men saved countless lives and almost stopped those bow and arrow geeks, too. First, you're lucky to be alive. Second, let me ask you, just this week alone, can you guess how much property damage those vigilantes are responsible for? No, but that's not the issue here. I don't have time to get into a circuitous whataboutism argument when there are costumed criminals reducing our city to rubble on a daily basis. Think of all the shipping delays we're gonna face because of this. When you can't shave because your favorite cream is trapped in shipping hell, make sure you thank the Spider-Man. Time for the bureaucrats to do their job. We need action. And also, a word from our sponsors. <sighs> that was a lot, Jonah. That was a lot. I don't understand how I could save you, and yet some way, somehow, I'm still wrong for everything, bro. I don't get it. Shady. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chances. Where am I going? Wow. Ah, where am I? S Spider Man? He's Don't up. Worry. I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, but we didn't know. They're for our brother, Les. We, we lost him a few years ago, and he always loved them. So we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh man, I'm sorry. 
Well, that's a... Well. At least I can still wiggle my toes. I'm here, man. We're here. Don't don't worry. There you go. There you go. There. Staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look. I'm doing that now. All right. Uh, where am I going? Over there. All right. Cool. Hey, just drop my off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. I don't give a damn about people with guns. <laughs> Have you seen my hands? Like, guns is the I least of their worries. To that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. Ooh, sneak, sneak. I like it. Moscow's camouflage to become invis invisible. Invisible. Jesus. When his camouflage meter is full, the camouflage meter recharges while not in use. Oh, whoa, whoa, you a big boy. Hold on. Ow. Oh, yeah, yeah, got me boxed in. What's up? Hit the bricks. <laughs> Take a swim, my boy. Damn, he just doesn't stop. God, he just doesn't stop. The fireworks. The lake. Uh, the river. I can chuck them. As soon as I can get to him. Uh. Wait. We lit two more? Are you serious? Enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Happy birthday, Lex. I didn't know you well, but you sound like a good guy. All right. Um, there's a. Oh, City sorry. Seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Well, let's find out. Damn, what the hell happened to you? You ready to come by the foundation? Sure. 
I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Myos thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Oh, well, yeah, I'd do that. <clears throat> He switched my suit one time. Kumo suit and hybrid suit. Okay. I mean, he can go classic right now, you know. Oh, we can get damaged? Okay, cool. I need that. Cool, we got some event we got some damage. <laughs> Damn, I thought that would give me a new suit, not still have <laughs> make it look wrecked. I go across the water again. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working nope. until you get here. No problem. Don't seem like seems like one of those uh little side missions. I'll deal with that when I deal with it. In the meantime, I gotta gotta see my best friend. I'm gonna see my best friend. I'm talking about my best friend. Coming down. <laughs> the Emily May Foundation. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. <gasps> sure looks big. Expensive. <laughs> Very expensive. Looks good. Nice. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this, but my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. Oh God. So, what do you think? It's too much. You overdoing <laughs> stuff, you right bastard. From And now that you're on board, this place is really going to start cooking. A particle accelerator. Dad, Culture, he energy. He hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh, really? But I was going to give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. Seeing you boys together again. Right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. I 
Uh, show me the tour. Let's go. Let's do it. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment. But when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects. Installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track. And made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Let me get shoulder to shoulder with you. Oh, damn, I'm trying to get shoulder to shoulder with you, boy. Here, Slow down. Me. <laughs> damn. <laughs> Wanna act like I know you, please. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Not a bee Before fan, but okay. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Sure. Ooh, on a controller? Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting them, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yep. Do I have to aim? Just like, like, I don't gotta aim at all. Gotta protect the hive. Nice. Almost done. Got four more. I right, see you. Gotcha. See you. Wow. See you over there. Come get I like I did. I knew you. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay. Why no? Veronica, please visit the well, yeah. Nice. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. I'm excited. Let's go, Ma. Up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of X-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. Harry, I like it. We got to heal the world. <laughs> One thing at a time. A moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can... It's the, it's the lizard. Uh, Doc, this is my friend... No, well, I don't think the lizard yet, course. but... We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. Shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Was that something to check your blood pressure? Sorry. And second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. <laughs> okay, so he is the lizard technically at this point. Hey, well, my man, what's good with you? That was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. All right, let's go explore. 
Well, look at this. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. Yep. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Hmm. Interesting. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Uh, what's this over here? <clears throat> hey, yo, my man, are you good? Yo, you all right? You good? Yeah, yeah, walk away. Man, you lucky. Starting everywhere we can. Origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Riveting stuff. Riv just, just riveting. Uh. There's something I missed. Or can I just walk up to anything? Oh, what the hell? What is this? I don't know what it is, but when I get close to it, the joint starts vibrating. I should explore as much as I can right now. I I am. <laughs> That's nothing's popping. Oh, well, I see some. Can I ride this bike? Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles. These bikes, can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Let me know when they're road ready. I'll test them to the best of my ability. Is that fish? It's fish over here. Cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. Sure. Japanese koi fish have well studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. So cool. Nice. May would have loved this place. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. Hmm. A lot of questions. But you did say, but you you said the line. You said the line. If almost feels too good to be true. I was in this room, right? Right behind you. Come on, bro. Damn. Yo, you good? <laughs> yeah, I'm telling yo. Yeah, if I could swing, I would. Come on, bro. I guess I'll go upstairs now. Yeah, I'll go upstairs. Need to work out the quads. Hold on. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. I was like, who I'm like, who buzzing the jack real quick? Come on. Yep, yep, that's a good quad workout for the day. All right. All right, Harry, what we got right here, man? What we doing? Talk to me. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll let it back up in no time. 
Cool. Yo, my bro, can you wait? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. Did you hear? So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Rigor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? I did. Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. And this, we got, we got it, we got to earn some bread, man. Doctor Foster, thanks, Doctor Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Doctor Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. Sure. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Okay, uh, press X to grab hex genes and place them in empty slots. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I think I get it. Hold on, I think I get it. I think I get it. I think, I think I get it. So if I put this right here, let's see. And then I put this. No, oh, I put that right here. No, oh, yeah, perfect. I was looking in terms of the lines on the side, and I was correct. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Okay, so... <clears throat> Alright, so... Um, I think I put this one right here. Then maybe put this... Nope. Put that right there. Then we'll put this one right here. And then this one, right? No? Okay, so it's the other one. No? No? Really? Okay. So maybe I just moved this? Put that right there, and then maybe this? Or maybe this is where the sunlight go. Hold on. No. Fuck. Okay. Hold on. <clears throat> Do I put this here? Then this here? No, not that one. Down. Hmm. Okay, so I've tried everyone except the... Except this one. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> okay. 
Okay, okay, okay. So let's try this. Let's do this again. Um, I'm gonna put the sun right here. Okay. Then I think this would go to this. Yeah, let's go. What's up with it? One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Okay, I'm, I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it. Um, I'm going to put this one right here. I'm going to put this one right here. Then put this one right here. Then, ah, damn, that ain't gonna work. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Okay, if I combine these traits. Okay, that one's not gonna work. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We working here. Um, I'm looking at it. Okay, so. I'll put this here. And connect it with this. And then connect it with this. Then connect that with this. And then. Beautiful work. Oh, stop playing with me, bro! I'm him! I'm him, bro! I be telling y'all, y'all be listening. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. This technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow, I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Doctor Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. So the last thing I'm gonna see is the office, which, ooh, ooh. This so office is pretty spacey. I like it. I like I like space. And the doors open by themselves? That's pretty sick. I had a nice Oh, you bastard. Stop tugging on my sad string, damn it. so amazing it's perfect really it's just things are really hectic right now when i was in treatment all i could think about was what would i do if i survived and i kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble it's my responsibility to save him. Would you join me? God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. Make my mom and make proud, huh? It's amazing. There's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs>
quick thing. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. Exactly what May said. Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. Looks like we got another job on top of another job. Good grief. Now we got the suit fixed and repaired. Oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some What's of up? our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, then your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Cool. Uh, time to call Miles. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but... duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Yeah, because I don't know why the hell you ain't done yet, bro. Come on now. What the f... Uh, exhaustion. <laughs> Too much whatever the hell that is. I know Miles for this one. It looks like we're going to have to see what Craven is up to. Dolo. For sure, though. Guys, maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man. We were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find it. Uh, glittering? Come on, man. Really? What the hell? Something here. What in the Whoa. Okay. Oh, trust me, I nodded. I... Arachnid, come on. Now have your boss with the main get this kind of tech. A true hunter knows how to kill it. You could have just said I don't back know. it up. These flying things. Seriously, though, where'd your boss take Lee and Gargan? Criminals? Not far. They're enjoying their freedom. That's not ominous at all. They're enjoying their freedom. That's great. Where the hell are you going? <laughs> Your ass beat in the corner, you heard? What the hell you doing? Yeah, yeah, come here. Yeah, come here. Now you, you ain't done. Cool, I'm not done with you. Now get the hell out of here. Go swimming. Get the hell out of here. Should take a look around. Uh, where am I going? Guess I'm going up here. What do we have here? What do we have here? Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, birdie. Take me to your nest. 
Gonna miss these chases when I'm at Emily May. The adrenaline, going through the city like it's an optical course, never gets old. Getting to do real science, though, for actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. You can daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Whoa! Is that a real gun? That actually works? Whoa! Holy hell. Didn't see that coming. Up, up, and you won't get away. No, 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 no. Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? Oh god. Hate the ones with the swords. They annoy me. What's going on with it? That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I wanna talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. Excuse me? I'm Spider-Man! Not worthy. Not worthy. Then you lost your stupid mind. Got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. Get get the hell off the roof. She dead. Now, where's your boss? I think the real question is. Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Where? Over here. Okay. Damn that leg. You look at that that leg. <laughs> Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. Damn, look at that body. <laughs> yep. It's glitched in there. Oh. Is that your home? I'm going down. Gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? I'm staring like I don't know how to drive, which I don't. So I guess it makes sense. Hey, MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah. It's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. That's fire. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just... vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. These two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. I know they're damaged. I mean, damaged. I know they're dangerous or danger. Hmm. Trying to figure out what's the best course of action. I'm trying. I'm trying to do that and you're not helpful. You yeah, turn around, find out. What's up? How you doing? That's one. Bam. Go to sleep. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. 
international mercenaries? Uh -oh. I may have to do this a different way. There we go. Be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. Can't even see the ceiling. I'm just focused on the conversation. Is he danger or can I take him out? Oh, good. Come here. Sweet dreams. There we go. How you doing? Oh, perfect. Come here. Oh, we can do wall takedowns now, too? Oh, fire. Oh, I didn't even see these others. Get, get, get kicked in the face! Get hit, get kicked. I'm tired of you. Oh, you don't want these hands. You, you don't. You don't. You don't want to do. You don't want to do that. Oh, come, come up. What's up? I got more. You coming up? No. <laughs> I wasn't sure. You take a pretty long time. The hell are you going? Get <laughs> yeah, hit with that barrel. That's everyone. Wait, where, where am I going? Oh. Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. <laughs> They've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Genki, but he could help pinpoint these. Cool. What's Craven hunting? And why? Guess he's hunting for a new challenge. You hungry too? What's up? Easy. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Oh, sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Oh, can we make something? What's up? Just made a new weapon. Or new gadget. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Oh, webline, what's up? Beatles, talandrons, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still missing some shipments. I'll have to pay that yardmaster a visit. But uh... what's up, man? These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich or well connected. Oh, get, get kicked in the back of your head. Can I create a web line from here? Yes, I can. Perfect. Can I? Oh, perfect. Are you safe? There you are. If you come a little closer. Come here. Oh, I'm running out of time. I'm running out of time. You 
You still direct danger? Damn. Hold on. Don't I don't care. Whoa, what the hell was that? Don't die, don't die. Yeah, I ain't none without your weapons, huh? Yeah, I ain't none without your weapons, huh? Damn, how far do I got to go into this? You know what? I'm going to cut it off right here because I'm running out of time. Hold on. I'm going to cut it off right here and then we're going to continue in the next episode. So until next time, peace, love, 100. Yerp.